or semis. This tournament's moving along pretty quickly. I think most people are here for doubles or for singles, so we only had a 14 player uh, tournament or 14 team tournament here. So, so. Hamlin's so lucky, you can see with all the great players when they come down to Texas. <laughs> I do get lucky. Uh, he makes me look so bad at this game. <laughs> I haven't been close to four stock in like a year, and he almost did it twice in a row. Yeah. <laughs> but I was doing well that third game, but whatever. I've never uh, played. I remember that guy's like you know kind of top five in the world. Yeah. Well, I've never played against kind of that knows four how to do us. every situation so freaking well. It's yeah. Crazy. Alright guys, so we're heading into this Winter Semis, Winter Semis match. Um, looking at the counter picks here. <laughs> so, um, yeah, the 2 King won Project M yesterday. It was a best, uh, it actually went to game five against Mojo. Ooh. Um, and Mewtwo King ended up clutching it out. Mojo actually almost won the set. Was it was that 3.6? 3.6, yeah. yeah. Um so these counter these counter picks, let's see. I don't know who's actually picking when, so I think Okay, so so Mojo and Sunflash decided to go to Yoshi's, because uh, they're playing Fox Marth. Yoshi's a pretty good stage for Marth, obviously. Yeah. Um <clears throat> Against, I think, Double Fox. I don't think Jedi is messing around. Oh, no, he is going Falco. Okay. Yeah. So, this is kind of a, a, an even an even map for both of them. There's a Falco on one team and a Fox on the other. So, Yoshi's is a pretty good pick for both teams, honestly. It's a good, yeah. play, it's a good place to start. Oh, that's, well, a, that's, not, that's a bad John John. way to start yeah, though, that's, John John. That's not good. John John starting off the set with a quick SD. Or, I, I don't know, was that a Shine Spike or an SD? I think it was an SD. That's unfortunate. Mojo's really going in though. Yeah. Um, oh, he's gonna. Look, wow, that, that almost was took another stock from John John there. That would have been disastrous. But it looks like John John is offstage again. But he's gonna go in and try to save his teammate instead of finish off the edge guard. Yeah. <clears throat> the thing is, I would say both John John and uh, Jedi Jake are about on Sunflash's level. John John being a little bit better of the two. Uh, whereas Mojo is obviously superior. Yeah. So this is going to be like a really tough set for both of them, and, and it, you know, it's already showing. They're already up by three stops. I would say they might, they would probably have better chemistry, seeing as they team together like a lot. And Mojo usually teams with Jake thirteen. Yeah. But uh, right now it's looking like synergy doesn't matter all that much when Mojo is Mojo. Yeah. It but like... it's still pretty close. Look at this now. Suddenly we're only one stock up for red team. Yeah. So Ken got knocked out of losers at CEO apparently. Just an update. I wanna like look at the bracket real quick. Alright. Um, I'll do that in between matches. But so what we've got well, so the thing oh. is, yeah, Mojo's just so good at this game. Like yeah. it's really hard to to overstate that. He's a very strong doubles player as well. Yeah, and he, he actually like studies doubles and works on his doubles. Yeah. So it's not really surprising that he can just pick up and team with just about anybody. Yeah. Um, that was a really good that was a really good edge guard by uh, John John uh, John John to take the stock from Mojo. Mojo's actually down to two socks. That up smash. But that's going. Some flash barely dies. Uh, but Louisiana one, two zero. Okay. Louisiana okay, so we are up a solid two stocks to the red team right now. Let's see if the blue team can bring it back. Yeah, so be very careful Mojo, here. The only reason Mojo was on such a low stock count was because he's being so aggressive that he is getting hit a lot. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, he's definitely, I would say, taking more stocks than he's losing. Oh, so, yeah. So ultimately, it's a net game for him. Yeah. Blue team's next play so careful if they want to bring it back at this point. They're both over 100%. Yeah, and they're both, yeah, they're both on their last stock over 100%. Oh. Yeah. Mojo, that was a really smart decision by Mojo there to go for the up to go for the up throw into down air. Because what he did was he down aired him back down so that Sunflash could hit him with the forward smash. I'm not, I'm not, that was a really weird situation. It was really odd, but it ended up working out. I'm not even 100 percent sure what happened. I think there was a Nair involved somewhere too for Mojo. For those of you guys that are wondering, the piano guy is in the chat. His name is Piano Dude 701. 
and he has a large uh, request. He has like a large request sheet of songs that he knows. So just uh, just ask for the request sheet or request a song, and he'll let you know if he knows it. All right, going into the next uh, the next match here, Dreamland I think is a pretty good counter pick because uh, it gives the Fox and the Falco a good amount of space. Are there any around. Of matches to call? This uh, top two. These have already been called. Attack of the Clones and uh, uh, Lucy. Well, I would call that. Just standing right there. That's Attack of the Clones. Um, <clears throat> oh wow, that Phantom was crazy. Mo so actually, Mojo dropped in the first stock here. Yeah. He has a bracket. Yep. Oh, oh we beat uh, Woody to a. Uh, no, no, a two one. I'm sorry. Okay. Y'all will be up next. Y'all will be up next. Y'all will be up next. Are we playing SDK and Mojo? Are we playing good? Are we playing? <laughs> Not with that attitude. Yes, with that attitude. Uh, yes, with that attitude. So, um, yeah, that's got to be on stream. Just a by little, the way. just a have... little. That will be on stream. Yeah. Absolutely. Just a little bit of uh, of uh, letting you guys know what's going on. in the next match is going to be Mewtwo King versus or Mewtwo King and Hamyojo versus, versus Prodigy and Worth. Prodigy and Worth, which are two brothers. Uh, Prodigy is actually he literally just turned ten years old last week. So, this week, or this week, the yeah. twenty, the twenty third, or something like that. Yeah, he turned he turned ten years old 24. a few days ago. Twenty four. So, uh, for those of you looking for the next the next young up and comer, that this prodigy, uh, he, it's gonna be prodigy. If prodigy, if prodigy is sticks with it, he's yeah, basically real. gonna be Mango in about a year. <laughs> <laughs> um, like he's gonna win the next Evo, guys. Trust me. Not not twenty fifteen, but twenty sixteen. Evo's in the bag for prodigy. He's got it. Straight up. So. Going back to this match, um, this one's been a lot closer. I think the counter pick really worked out for Blue Team. You know, here's the thing though. Sunflash, Sunflash knows uh, the the combo still. Yeah, he doesn't he doesn't need the uh, F smash through the platform. He'll just up air you, get you onto the top platform, and tipper you there. You know? Yeah, like, yeah. He knows yeah. how to use the one. He knows how to get there, man. Wait. What was the score, man? Oh, nice shine spike from Mojo on John Johnny. Even up the stock count here. This is obviously a much better game from We So Wet than it was on Yoshi's Story. That game was a lot more in won? favor yeah, of the red team here. And if they can seal out a kill on e either Mojo or Sunflash at this point, they will actually have a little bit of a percent lead. Oh, oh nice that was a big forward smash. Jedi Jake. And that ended up taking up. both of them, and, and they're up a clean, yeah. they're up a basically clean stock now. Okay. I okay. 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 All right, oh, so Mojo's off stage on his last stock. Yep. He makes it back though. And Mojo now, did make it back and he got John, the edge guard off of John John. Oh, if Jedi Jake has to sail. Oh, that's a 1v2. Yeah, so John John's kind of stuck in a uh, one, uh, 2v1 on situation here. If he can get the quick John stock. John can definitely do this. If he, gets, if he can get the quick stock off of Sunflash, he has a chance. Yeah. Um, obviously, Mojo oh. is not to be discounted I mean, though. And now oh, that's going to oh. be. It. Oh, yeah. he, oh, okay. That was almost. Almost. That's going to be a 2-0 for Sunflash and Mojo, or 2-0 so far for Sunflash yeah. and Mojo. This oh. is a best of five. Is it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're S in semis, semifinals, right? Yeah. yeah. So the winner of this will go on to play the winner of Prodigy, Worth versus Me Too King uh, and Mojo. Prodigy and Worth won that 2-0. Uh, oh, yeah, oh yeah, winner yeah, of this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So the winner of this will be in winner, winner's finals. Yeah, so... Like I said, next matchup is Prodigy and Worth versus Mewtwo King and uh, Ham Yojo. So definitely stay tuned for that. We those got of, the two biggest streamers. Those of you M2, M2K fans out there. And which Prodigy fans. This is his too. channel. Wow, that was an awesome F smash out of, uh, out of Sunflash. Sunflash has really been getting a lot better from what I've noticed over the past six months. Uh, he's been improving at leaps and bounds. Yeah. So, I, I've seen him team a lot with Mojo nowadays. When Jake, Whenever Jake doesn't go to a tournament, basically Sunflash is uh, his other teammate. Um, Alright, so Jedi Jake dropping a stock there as well. Uh, now, now luckily, uh, they did get an early stock off of Sunflash, so this isn't quite as dire as it could be for uh, Jedi Jake and... Uh, John John? Yeah, this is still very close. Yeah. Mojo's still loving though, and John John, if he dies, it won't be quite so close anymore. But yep. Sunflash, Sunflash drops another yeah. stock though. Now he's down to two. So Mojo's uh, 
as a complete opposite of the first match, Mojo, Mojo. was actually stock tanking oh. here a little bit. But is he going to lose that one? No, nope. he yeah. manages Mojo. to make it back. Mojo's going crazy right now. Yeah, Jedi Jade with a little bit of a tech flub on the down air there, or a timing flub, I should say. Now, Sunflash is kind of edge guarding his own teammate there, which might come back to bite him, and it did, actually. He kept Mojo over by the edge, uh, and John John was actually able to close out Mojo's stock there. Oh, that was only his first stock, so... Well, and now, suddenly, we still went have a lead in stocks. Yep. And oh, that down tilt, yeah, though, is going to close out the stock. The yep. Jedi, Jake. Routine textbook uh, edge guard by Marth there. Oh. And another one goes for John John. Now, Jake is against the edge. If he gets gimped here, it's over. That fan, that red block, got sent <laughs> Actually keeping the back of the room, like, nice. To be honest, if anybody if anybody from blue team drops a drops an early stock here, this game is over. So they really need to. The, yeah. It's about even now, though. Actually, they might have a bit of a yeah. lead. If some flash actually dies here, yeah. Fun yeah. Flash. Now, fun little flash. thing. A quick, quick uh, change yeah, in momentum. Fun flash. Uh, he's really comfortable hanging out near the edge. He's he's oh. He's relatively M2KS. He'll sit there for a while. But okay. um, some flash takes the stop. He, he did come back and try to do some some stuff and this match could go to just about anybody at this yeah. point. Sunflash yeah. or Mo oh, Mojo can Mojo. always Oh, oh that's it. my god, that's it. it. Looks, John, this John. is now a very hard situation for Sunflash to be Especially in. since he's already in the air being comboed. And they're both yeah. just sitting there shielding. Yeah. No reason not to. Oh my. Oh yeah that's gonna be that game. Was smart by John John. I like that down air. Yeah. Game three is actually gonna go to John John and Jedi Jake. Very good set by them. They managed to actually John come back a little bit. <laughs> they managed to come back from quite a bit of a deficit there. They were actually down, I think, two stocks at one point, maybe even three, and they managed to bring it back, so that was pretty nice. Fi Final Destination, I think, is also a really good counter pick, especially with the Marth. Yeah. Just chain oh, gaps for days. Speaking of which, that might be the end of Jedi Jake wow. already. No. He, he, he yeah, started out of the game. His teammate came in the way, uh, you know, just interrupted it just <laughs> enough that uh, you Mojo, know, he make it back. Mojo wanted all the glory. So the but, people are asking for a piano dude camp. God dang it! <laughs> Why is this happening again? <laughs> Y'all can see the piano dude. He's smiling in the He's background with the black John shirt John's on head. right now. You can also see him above Mojo's head in the mirror there. All right. Both, all four of them hanging out kind of close to the edge there yeah. for a second, oh, and that was pretty dangerous. But John John's gonna take the stock from Sunflash, and that's gonna hard, be the first first hard blood. Hard back air trade. Yeah, no, but it was definitely worth DBZ esque trade. Oh, Mojo's in trouble. And the down good, smash, nice good tech, tech though. Good tech. Mojo's gonna back. make it back because of the amazing tech. Wow, Sunflash is really missing his timing on some of these uh, edge guards. It's very uncharacteristic of him. Maybe he's just getting worried and trying to do it preemptively because he thinks the teammate is gonna come get him oh, quicker yeah. than he expects. Yeah. And he's just trying to get a hitbox out. Yeah, if you feel the immediacy of your teammate, of uh, like your opponent's teammate coming and hitting you out of something, uh, it's, it definitely puts pressure on you to try and just get things done as wow, fast as possible. Wow, that shield pressure. Yeah. Falco's, and now, and now he's dead. All right, yeah. good. Falco living to 193, that's really not something you want to have yeah. happen all, all, like, often. That was Over, actually that really said, big. The stocks are almost perfectly even now. That was a pretty big deal, him living so long and managed to, they kind of won the war of attrition okay. there. Okay, second F smash. And oh, that's going to be, that's going to be the Double stock. edge guard? Yeah. Oh, he dropped it. Wow. And now, that, oh, okay. that was almost, that almost turned into flash. a reverse situation, yeah. So you saw right there, Mojo sent John John off uh, the side of the stage. And instead of trying to get the end of his stock and edge guard him, he went to double team Jedi Jake with uh, with Ooh, Sunflash. Nice tip that's, by Sunflash. Sometimes that's the right choice. Sometimes just going and, and forgetting about one guy and double teaming the other is uh, is what you want to do. Sometimes I definitely think the right choice is to go and save your teammate instead of going for a kill. Uh, this this game is about having more stocks go. than the other people, and especially in teams. It looks and, like uh, we wanted everything Jedi. Everything turned yeah. very bad very quickly for uh, We So Wet. Yeah. Was even and then Red Team stopped dying. Yeah. <laughs> and then and that's what we were talking about. Mojo just going in to save his teammate. Mojo going in to save his teammate was a huge deal. All right. So next up, we're gonna have Mewtwo King and Ham Yojo.